Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to restore this Cabbage Patch Pony that I found at a thrift store. She's really beat up and she has really tangled hair, but after watching a few My Little Pony restoration videos, I have a pretty good idea of what I'm going to do. So she's a dark hot pink with blue eyes and light pink hair, purple saddle, saddle and blue butterflies, and she has horseshoes on her. She's really precious and I found her at the thrift store for only $2. So yeah, I'm going to show you how you can clean her and brush the hair and untangle, but I have no idea what I'm doing, so bear with me. So in all the videos I saw, they use conditioner for the hair and a magic eraser to wash off the body, and I had q-tips and cotton balls just in case, and the dish soap is to disinfect the pony and wash it, and you might need a little tub. So right here, I'm giving her a really good scrub, and yeah, in the videos, they said just to scrub until all the dirt and grime is gone, and yeah, it takes a little while, it takes a little elbow grease, but it's really worth it because you don't want nasty stains, and look at how dirty the sponge was, like, you need to wash it if it's from a thrift store or something. So yeah, stains eventually come off. The magic eraser is super great. I see why everybody used it to clean off the pony. And yeah, I'm just cleaning her feet to make them squeaky clean. And that's about it for cleaning off the body. And you'll see me washing her off in the little tub right now. So after washing the pony's hair, you're going to want to rinse it out and you're going to put the conditioner in the pony's hair. So I took out the braids in her hair and it left a really pretty wave, but I kind of want her hair to be like long loose locks. So yeah, and this is how you're supposed to brush their hair so you don't pull it out of their head. And my pony's hair is super frizzy because of how matted it was and I tried to be gentle but it just became really frizzy so this is how it looked after it was like brushed through to my best and this is how it looked after a little bit more work but it was still pretty bad. Okay, so after that, I put these rollers in the pony's hair while it was rinsed out and wet so it could dry overnight, and I was hoping that it would be curly the next day, but unfortunately, it didn't work out too great, and you'll see right now what I'm talking about. So it barely curled because I think the roller was just too big. I needed to do smaller sections and her hair was still super frizzy. So what I did is I put some, like, I put some oil in her, argan oil on her hair and I put like this glossing spray and I put, I wet it and I put smaller rollers in her hair so that I'd get more of a curl effect. And this is how the curls came out. It still looks really bad. I feel like I should cut the ends off then her hair would be extremely short at the top and I don't want to cut the bottom if it's unnecessary. But I think for now I'm happy even though it looks kind of crunchy but that's okay at least it looks better than it was before. Maybe I will just braid it like braid it all but for now I'm just gonna enjoy the cute curl and I don't care if it looks kind of crunchy. 
thank you so much for watching you guys and this is the final result of the makeover so like and subscribe if you want to see more videos like this thank you